The Chicago Bulls play the Atlanta Hawks on Wednesday in a 9-10 matchup in the play-in tournament. I'm going to tell you how the Chicago Bulls will defeat the Atlanta Hawks in advance in that AFC game. But first, you got to hear that music, though. Tone, yeah. Gang. Shy Boys Podcast with the Cognac Boys. I am Cognac Boy C Dub holding it down on another episode because nephew out traveling. Here we go. Bulls versus Hawks. Uh for the play in 19 seed, 9 10 seed matchup. The Chicago Bulls lead the series against the Atlanta Hawks 2 to 1. The day after the day night after Christmas, the the Bulls beat the Hawks one eighteen to one thirteen. Andre Drummond powered the Bulls to a victory with a twenty four and twenty five rebound game. Demar Derozan also added twenty five points. Trey Young was six for seventeen from the field, three for thirteen from three point range. Keep those Trey Young notes. Keep those, keep that in your, in, you know, put that in, in your backlog. On February 2nd, on February 12th, I'm sorry. The Chicago Bulls beat Atlanta 136 to 126. Ayo Dusumu and DeMar DeRozan both poured in 29 points. Uh... The Bulls had four players with 20 points that game. Trey Young, 3 of 14, 2 of 10 from three-point range. On April 1st, the game that just passed, the Bulls lost. Uh, Bulls won the series 2-1. The Atlanta lost, won the last game. The Bulls lost 101-113 to Atlanta with DeJounte Murray having a big game for the Hawks. Now, Trey Young didn't play that game, and Atlanta pretty much destroyed the Bulls all the way through that game. Now, what are our keys to victory? And we're going to name them three to one. One being the most important. Stay in for the number one. At first, at number three, how we win the play-in game against the Atlanta Hawks. Control the glass. Y'all remember that first game I just told y'all about after Christmas? Andre Drummond had 25 rebounds with 24 points, of course. Nick Vooch must control the glass as well. And Odama Sanogu, who just put in the 2020 game last night. He might be a factor if Andre Drummond is not 100% healthy. Normally, when I look back at the stats, the Bulls has out-rebounded the Atlanta Hawks each and every single game. But when the chips in the middle of the table, when it's win or go home, who's going to show up? Who's going to be the one to dominate the paint and the glass? Will it be the Hawks? Or will it be the Chicago Bulls with Andre Drummond, Odama Sanogu, and Nick Vooch? Very important that we control the glass. We will not win if we can't control the glass. Secure them defensive rebounds. At two. And this has been a problem for the Chicago Bulls, not just, not just with the Atlanta Hawks, but lately we must limit the turnovers. Because it's going to be turnovers in the game. It's going to be a it's going to be turnovers of games. It's a every basketball game you're going to have one or two, three turnovers in the game. But I'm mainly talking about the stupid turnovers of what the Bulls been doing lately. We must take care of the basketball. That's what I'm gonna change this to. Forget limit turnovers. Let's take care of the basketball. 
That means DeMar DeRozan, that double team, come, you move that ball. That means Kobe White don't get stuck picking up your dribble in the middle of the lane and throwing it at the last second right to the opposing team. That means Dale and Terry take your time at times and be careful with the basketball. Ayo Dusumu, don't make dumb turnovers. All the ball handlers, balls. We must take care of the basketball like it's your firstborn child. You ain't going to give away your firstborn child. Take care of the basketball and the Bulls win. And my top reason why we will win this game, and this is hard to say about a player with all-star caliber, we must neutralize Trey Young. You can look at all of the rest of the games that we played. The last game, Trey Young didn't play against the Chicago Bulls. He was out with injury. 6 of 17 in that game after Christmas. 3 of 13 from the three point line. February 12th, 3 of 14 from the field. 2 of 10 from the, from the three point line. We must neutralize them. He is their one. He's not their one weapon, but Jante Murray, his impact dulls if you have Trey Young in the game. And he will be playing in that play-in, so he will hopefully be dull in that play-in game. Trey Young must be neutralized. He makes everything happen for the Atlanta Hawks. He averages a double-double, points and assists. He doesn't play much defense. You must attack him on the offensive end. You must attack Trey Young. Don't let him hide. He's not going to guard his man. That means he's not going to guard Ayo Dusumu. He's not going to guard Kobe White. Wherever he is, find him and attack him. This is the number one uh, reason that we will beat the Atlanta Hawks, if we neutralize Trey Young. He's an all-star caliber player. But we happen to have his father on our team. Ayo Dusumu is the Lex Luthor to Trey Young Superman. He is the kryptonite. And I'm overdoing it calling Trey Young Superman. Trey Young has no chance against Ayo Dusumu. He's locking him up every time. Crying about calls. Can't get a shot off. Throwing up bull crap. So, C Dub, basically what you're saying, this game depends on Ayo Dusumu, basically. Yes. Is that too much pressure for Ayo Dusumu? No. Have you seen Ayo Dusumu lately? He can't handle it. He's from the crib. He's from Chicago. Ayo Dusumu, it's time to do your best work on your son, Trey Young. And these are the three reasons why the Bulls will win Wednesday in the play-in 9-10 tournament game. Let's name them the last time before we leave. They must control the glass. Andre Drummond, Nikola Vucevic, and Adama Sanoku. And the rest of the Bulls. They must take care of the basketball. And that also includes shoot smart shots. And don't turn the ball over. Stupid turnovers. And the number one reason, neutralize Trey Young. You must. He cannot have 30 in this game unless he go 9 for 30 or 9 for 21, 7 or 23. He must have an inconsistent game tonight uh, on Wednesday. This is the Shot Bulls podcast. We got the play-in tournament come up. I'm already getting teed up. I know y'all tired of this team, but I want to see this team go as far as they can go. And I know they going past these Atlanta Hawks. See red. Mouth. Come on.
Yeah.